Mr. Speaker, uh, I want to support the statement by uh, Senator Mudigi from Mambu County, who has brought a very pertinent issue on Mugoka. Mugoka, Mr. Speaker, is a crop just like any other, just like coffee, just like tea, just like Mnazi, and uh, it should be a content. The very respect that we accord other crops. We have thousands of people in the Rakanidi, in the Yembu, in the Meru, whose livelihood depends on Mugoka and Mera. And I want to dispute the allegations by Mombasa Senator that Mugoka is on track. I would advise Moshimofak to bring a registration through my committee because I'm the chair delegate, maybe to outlaw, and I'm sure it is not going to see the light of the day. So I think Mogoka and, 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 and Mera should be accorded the, the right uh, attention. And those that are eating Mera in Mombasa or any other part of this country should be given freedom to do so freely without any intimidation. So in a rejoined honorable speaker, there was a statement that was raised by my senior, my umbrella, Senator from Meru County, Senator Gaduri Murongi on the Nidhi Bridge. I want to confirm, Honorable Speaker, that the Nidhi Bridge is in my county, and this bridge has, is a national disaster. It's a monster. Nidhi Bridge has claimed very many lives, and it's high time that the government should uh, act upon this bridge to save lives, because this bridge, Honorable Speaker, serves quite a number of counties all the way from Northeastern, Barisabit, Isiolo, Meru, Embu, Tarakanidhi. It's a national disaster, Honorable Speaker. So I think I'm happy that the member for Meru brought this issue and we hunch the Committee on Transport to move with the lot of speed and make sure that uh, we have put in mechanisms through which we can redesign this bridge, maybe to save more lives. I remember exactly the President in his campaign trail promised that uh, in his very first 100 days, we are going to have the needy bridge redesigned, and I trust his word. I'm very sure once we settle as a government, this will be the first priority, but they should get a report from the chair transport through his committee to make sure that we have a bridge which does not kill people. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Senator Shakila. Senator Mwishimio Speaker, kunipatia hii fursa. Mheshimiwa nafikiri e, bridge inaweza kuchangia kiasi fulani lakini utakuta madereva wa miraa wanapeleka magari vibaya sana mheshimiwa na wanayapeleka magari over ndege utakuta magari ya miraa ukikutana nayo barabarani wewe usipochunga wanapita na wewe Honorable Senator just confine yourself to the statement by uh, uh, Honorable uh, the senator for Embu on, on, on the issue of Mogoka. Sawa mshimiwa. Uh, kitu ingine mshimiwa ningependa pia kuongezea ni kwamba uh, unakuta wale walaji Mogoka. Hususan vijana wadogo. Utapata mtoto wamepewa pesa ya pocket money ya shule. Badala ya ile pesa kuitumia kwa shule anaiweka anaenda kuchukununua mugoka ambayo unaweza kuipata kwa pakiti hata kwa shilingi hamsini. Mheshimiwa speaker na unapata mtoto amekula mugoka jicho limetoka kama la ngombe. Unashindwa huyu mtoto amefanya nini amekula nini? Na ni sababu ya hiyo mugoka. Mheshimiwa speaker ukweli ni kwamba mugoka unaathiri vijana, mugoka ni ulevi na unafaa ukontroliwe. Kwa sababu bila hiyo tutaendelea kukosa vijana wetu kwa mogoka na kwa mira. Afadhali hata mira mimi naweza sema. Lakini mogoka ni kama ni kitu inawekwa kemikali ndani yake. Sa ile inakuzwa. Na ndiyo sababu unakuta vijana wakitumia kidogo tu wana change ya kilizao na wanabadilika. Macho inatoka inje, unakuta mtoto hawezi hata kula chakula. 
mheshimiwa speaker kwa hivyo mogoka ina athari fulani bila shaka na ningependa sana mheshimiwa faki kiwa wataweza kuleta hiyo ripoti kuthibitisha kwamba mogoka ni ulevi ndio tuweze kuweka kwenye category ya ulevi isiyo inatumika kama crop asante mheshimiwa speaker